and summer college baseball. What a difference a year makes for the Bismarck Larks. Through 20 games this season, they are 12-8 and, and in third place in the North Division. Much of their success happened months before the team even took the field, as manager Sean Ripe took a different approach to constructing this year's roster. When I was building this roster, I expected our team to compete this way. And, you know, these are good, they're good baseball players. Last year, the first year organization focused on players from smaller schools. But this season, there is more Division I talent on the roster. This year, I, I had some bigger, uh, bigger programs calling me instead of the other way around, which is nice. In fact, Coach Ripe's phone rang so much that he had to tell some hopefuls there were not enough roster spots. It's not awesome to turn people down, but it's awesome to have all of those Options. Hit a home run this inning. Options were a problem last season, as several players left during the regular season because of prior commitments, but not this year. Maybe one or two guys that are expected to, to leave at some point, but I have guys piggybacking them. Depth was another issue, especially when the team is on the road and a player gets injured. And I have guys, you know, kind of on the back burner waiting if, if things come through, if fall through here and you know, we need a body, and, and not just a body, but a good player. Even though the 2018 Larks looked different from the 2017 version, Coach Ripe kept one aspect at the top of his list when building this roster. The names of the schools are great, but, you know, the way I built this roster was character first. All right, so after playing 20 games, the Bismarck Larks finally have a rest day. The Larks return to Municipal Ballpark tomorrow to start a two-game set with the Wilmer Stingers.